Hello, hello everybody. Angie here. I'm coming on to do my daily make for hashtag junk journal July. I don't know why, but I have to pause when I say that. That's a hard thing to say all at once. I keep wanting to say January instead of July. But anyway, we are on day seven and the prompt is window. So I've got some goodies here. Let's see what we can come up with. And yeah, how's everybody doing? I hope everybody is doing well. I'm doing good. And I think we will continue on the back page of here. Okay, so for window, I have a f several elements. We'll see what we can come up with. And it's funny because doing these daily makes, I still have quite a bit of pieces from previous days. So I'm trying to incorporate and use up some of those as well. So it kind of works out really well. I have a little bit of this packaging. Let's see if maybe we can use that. And I thought we would work with a vintage flashcard today. Um, I've got a piece of laminated plastic as well as a cellophane bag. I don't know which one I want to use for the window portion. So I've got both. And I've got a piece of the vintage book page, a little piece of decorative um, paper from a pad that I got from Timu. I've got a journal card, a paper doily, and then some just some other bits, some tablet tabs, and these pretty little elements here that I left over from a previous make that I have. Okay, so those are for the most part what I've got in front of me that we're going to try and work with and see what we can come up with. All right. So, first of all, I want to do my journal card. And even though the lines are on this side for writing, and this side is blank, I want to decorate this side, and we can still write, you know, the journal spot on this side. And I'm going to be using, let me grab some scissors, these kind of uh, botanical... images here okay we're gonna use these two images and I was thinking about putting those down like so so let's start there I'll just use that line as a guide. And that should be fine. Yeah. And then we'll bring this one down. To about there, I guess. Okay. And then... I brought a tab because this is going to be the journal card. So I was trying to see. I just grabbed a few. Which one would look best? Um, I guess these are kind of the same. with the book page because I want to decorate the front of this journal card with some book page as well so I think that will go together quite nicely okay so let's um ink this there. 
Okay. And then, well, hmm, how am I going to do that? Hmm, I don't know how to do that. Um, let's see. Okay, um, maybe if I try to score it, I just, I don't know. I should have thought this through a little bit more. But I'm going to bring in my scoreboard. And I want to make a couple little windows for these images to be seen through. I don't know if that's going to work. We're going to try it. Okay, I didn't think this part through, but I'm thinking maybe Oops, if I make a couple lines here, I'll know where to cut those windows out. You can kind of see. I think that's just enough to help me cut my windows out. Now, if I could just hold that in place. I'm going to bring this a little closer to me. Well, you know what? Let's make a pencil line. I think that'll be easier. Okay, so that's one. All right, that should do it. Now let's trim that out. Oops, that went a little too far, I think, on that one. There's a glare down my window. I can't see too well. Okay, let's try that. Hope it's not showing on camera. There we go. Okay. So let's just use this as a template. Okay, that'll work. See, now I'll have these for another day's make. I'm accumulating quite a little pile there. Okay, now I thought I would just do something as easy as um, but I kind of want you to be able to know that it's a Hmm. 
vintage flash card. So I'm not going to cover the whole thing. And I'm not worried about how this back side's going to look because it's not going to show. That's going to go down on my journal page. All right. And then maybe another... up here Okay, I like that. And then I thought we'd do is an alternated color. Maybe a little bit of this one. But it's not quite long enough. around okay let's use a little bit over on this side Okay, let's do a 
And I think that's probably all because I, I want to be able to, a little bit of the flash card to be seen. Let's take a look at that. And that's going to go down as a pocket. And then this journal card will slide behind and display these images here. That looks nice. Okay. Um, I'm going to have this doily. Maybe a little bit of the doily. Okay, and maybe a little piece in the lower corner as well. Let's take a look. Just a little bit right there. Okay, that's good with that. Now, let's put the window. Let's see if I want to do cellophane or the, the laminate would be a lot easier and quicker. But, yeah, let's just do that. And it's almost the size we can get by with that. Okay. I'm going to put it down with some art glitter glue and hopefully that will hold. I know it won't right away, but I think after it sits for a bit and I get it on my in my journal book, I think it'll be okay. But it's going to take some time to, you know, dry. And I'm going to put just a little bit in those corners. Okay. Mm, put some way over there. There we go. That looks nice. And that up. Let's bring a little ink to the edges of this flash card, which is going to be my pocket. Okay. And now feel like it needs a little bit more. 
And that's going to slide underneath like so. I don't want to mess with it too much until it has time to dry. But that's going to look like that. And let's just put that down. And I'm going to bring it over this to the left hand side quite a bit. If I was thinking I would have put my tab on the left, but it's okay. We can get around that. All right, so let's put this down. Okay, and this is going to slide in. Just like that. I think I want to put this down. I'm going to pull that out a little bit until that glue has time to really set well. And I want the little texture of this paper. So I'm going to try not to push that down too much. Scrunch that up just a bit. Okay, I like that. And I still have more. <laughs> okay, um, let's see what else we can do. Well, this is going to be my journal card. Um, I have that there I don't think I want to use any of those I think we need to dress up this page just a little bit more so let's put that down under just a bit works perfectly. Just a little hint of something there.
And let's see what else I've got in my little trinket box here that I can use. Um, I just used that yesterday. I don't think I want to use that again. Go ahead and use those. Okay, I like that, I think. Yeah, I like that. Okay, let's put that to the side. Let's bring our journal card back in. And line that up. Oh, perfect. Feel like maybe something right there though what do you think um no okay i'm gonna leave it like that i don't have anything in front of me that i is catching my eye but that I think is a good page very quick very simple using a vintage flash card a little journal card making a little window spot it's got writing available on the back using some bits and pieces for some prior days I've got a little doily a little bit of uh, packaging small strip of lace and a couple labels okay I like it Okay, guys, that is going to be my make for today, and the prompt is window. Okay. So, thank you so very much for stopping by my channel. I truly appreciate it. I will see you tomorrow, and the prompt is observe. Until then, take care, and God bless. Bye-bye.